Throughout the week, many groups set up right here in downtown, giving away food, clothing, and other items to those in need. But now a new proposal would require all of them to register in advance. Basically create a barrier for mutual aid organizations to operate in, in Indianapolis and kind of create barriers for neighbors to help neighbors. Stephen Lane is a volunteer with Indy Hope Packages, a local organization that helps those experiencing homelessness, saying this new proposal would greatly affect their efforts. Put a, a hindrance on, on the, the, how quickly we can mobilize to serve our neighbors. Proposal 256 was first introduced in July. It would require groups to register with the city at least 48 hours before handing out any food or other items on public property. The registration would be free, but if a group doesn't comply, they could be fined $250 after the first warning and $500 each time after. You know, it lets folks know where folks are. 13 News spoke with the sponsors of the bill who say a process like this is needed, citing incidents of violence, littering, and property damage. And our homeless population deserves better. They deserve better than that. And I think this is a step forward in doing that.